I don't think my key's working. That's because since you nicked everything, we've had to change the locks. Mm. Cheers for that, guys. <laughs> Sorry, what happened again? So what are you doing here? Come to see you all. Holly. Hi, Mum. She thought we'd be out so she could nick some more stuff. Sorry, what happened again? I've learnt my lesson. Hi, Dad. Yeah, hi. Just lay outside. What are you doing here? Tell us to get lost. Uh, listen, uh, why don't you go or you miss your bus? Me? I have to go. Well, you said yourself you're going to be late. <sighs> so you going to put the kettle on? <laughs> Well, I haven't seen you in ages and promised to keep in touch. Wanted to give you this. I know how much it means to you. Should never have taken it. I'm ashamed of what I did and I want to inherit it like you said. Prove to you I'm worth it. How did you afford to get it back? Well, I've been working. Are you uh, still living at that flat? Yeah. Only I called round yesterday with Adam. But nobody was in. Oh, I was out most of the day. But you shouldn't be going out of your way. You're busy enough. Let me do the running around, yeah? Well, you don't need to rush off. At least finish your tea. Oh, I'm working. Maybe some other time. OK. Love you. Sorry, I started without you. No worries. No problem? The first time. I wish I could believe, only you know. She must have done a fair few shifts to pay for that ring. I know. And I want to trust her. She looked like she was on something to me. Yeah, she didn't seem right somehow, and she knows how to play us. Where are you going now? Where do you think? Well, you've changed your tune. I want to know what's going on. What do I do? Break into the place? Is Holly in? No. Can I help you? You can tell me who you are. You're Lindsay's boyfriend. Lindsay, Holly's mate. She lives here. <laughs> yeah, whatever. What's so funny? Who wants to know? I'm Holly's dad. Is she still living here? She's staying here. It's my flat. I need to talk to her. You've had a wasted journey then, haven't you? I'll wait if you don't mind. So it's just you and Holly then, is it? And my gran. She lives in the kitchen cupboard. And Holly what? Sleeps on the sofa? I normally let my girlfriend share my bed. She's never even mentioned you. Why would she? It's a nice place, isn't it? Hmm. Must have cost a few bob. I like it. What do you do for a living? You know, when I was a kid, I had to be dead polite when I was in someone else's house, so my mum would belt me. Man, is that my strong point? I've noticed. But if you must know, I do promo work in clubs. Promo work, eh? You short for a promotional. And that's how you met Holly, is it? I'm doing my best there, but you're starting to get on my nerves. She needs a lot of support. She's been having a rough she time. She seems pretty chilled to me. I bet she does. Meaning? She's had a few problems, hasn't she? It's news to me. Well, you haven't noticed? No. You can ask her when she gets back, can't you? Hmm. If you're not going anywhere, 
Why don't I make us a nice cup of tea? Hmm? Hello, my sweetheart. You had a good day? Okay. Only okay? I want to know what happened with Holly. She came to give me my Nana's ring back. How did she pay for it? She's been working. And you believe that? We want to believe her, yes. Your dad's round there now. You should have thrown her out and told her never to come back. She doesn't care. Why should you and Dad? Han. Hey, man. Mm, I like a man who's happy in his work. Well, to be perfectly honest, I'm not giving much thought to my work at the moment. No? So what's putting that big silly smile on your face then? Hmm. Must be the joys of spring. Bob, it's October. The joys of spring don't necessarily have to be dictated by the calendar, Mara. What do you think you're doing? Promo work, yeah? I've had enough of you. Must pay well to have a car like this. That's none of your business. This place. That motor. I know what you are. It all makes sense now, the state that Holly's in. She does what she likes. You better tell her to move out. Is that a threat? What do you think? I poor with you because you're Holly's dad. But you're out your depth. So why don't you go home and milk the pigs? I'm not finished, mate. I think you are. Dad, I said I'd come to you. Well, pack your bags now. You're coming home. Well, you can't stay here with him. Yes, I can. You told us you were clean and you're living with a dealer. That's why you never told us about him. No, I never told you because I knew how you'd react. I'm not stupid, Holly. You said you were living with some girl called Lindsay. It's one lie after another because you're living with scum like him. I told you before about manners. You don't have to be afraid of him, you know. I'm not. I'm afraid of you. You've got your answer. Come on, are you better than this? I told you. I'm all right. No, you're not. You're destroying yourself. And I can't let that happen because I love you. Please, Ollie, come on. Leave all this behind and come on, mate. Eh? You know where the door is. You're not helping. I don't need you. Just go, Dad. It's not just Katy Perry, Hollywood is also in love with Russell Brand, and he's tonight's guest along with Michael Parkinson. Paul O'Grady Live is at nine. Next, the pressure is really starting to get to Carla in Coronation Street. <laughs> <laughs> 